Dang, okay, today I'm not actually looking like a one out of 10. I'm looking at like a like a, like a a two, maybe? Hey, you know the vibe. What's going on, guys? Shonda's Magic here, back at it again with another video. Today, we got the drip. We got the Got Magic shirt on today because the question today is, do TikTok magicians got magic? Yes, that's right. Today, we are going to be reacting to TikTok magicians. And being a TikTok magician myself, well, I'm very excited to see what these magicians got. Last time we watched one of these, well, I got bamboozled. But you know what? I feel pretty confident today. I'm gonna put my magic hat on. That's not a magic hat. Why Why is that on my head? And we're gonna see how we react to some of the most viral magic on TikTok. All right, so the first magician that we're gonna be taking a look at is the one that we reacted to in the last video. Xavier Mortima, Xavier Mortimer, Mort, Mortima, I'm, I'm, I just suck at this point. But Xavier the Magician, that's what we're gonna say, has some of the most viral magic videos on the internet. He has so many amazing tricks, just like in this last video. Are you gonna go without a tie? Oh, he can't leave without the tie. What tape? That's not a tie tie. That's a tie, that's a tie. And he's posted a couple new magic tricks, so we're gonna take a look and see if he's gotten any better. We start off with some food magic, okay. I mean, if you can't tell by what I look like, I, I like food magic. I, I mean, I just like food, but like magic's, I, yeah. Hey, finesse. He said one, two, over your head. Caught him lacking. Okay, okay, okay. God, he's so smooth with it too. So nice. One, two, over the head, gone. <laughs> oh, whoa! Wait a minute! Okay, that was funny. That was funny. That was a good ending, okay? But was that man about to eat that grape? That grape has been sitting in his mouth since the dawn of time. I'm pretty sure that grape has been there since literally Ice Age. And he still has the audacity to pick it up, look at the grape, contemplate and be like, ah. I wanna eat this. This next video has 7 million views, which is insane. And it's shot in a Walmart parking lot. Nothing ever, ever comes good out of a Walmart parking lot. So let's see how this got 7 million views. What? Oh, what? What? I'm so unbelievably confused right now. We gotta run that back. What? How? Oh, he's just holding on to I don't un this mmm this trick just broke me. This defies logic. I don't even understand how this could work. His hands are just holding onto the cart. Also, how is the cart not tipping over? Do you guys ever have fun with carts where you're like, you know, riding a cart and then it like tips back? Well, this man is the epitome of potentially tipping back. But no, he's just cruising right now. <laughs> What? <laughs> you know what's my favorite part about this is how despite all of this that's going on, right? All this chaotic stuff, man still got a mask on. Go you, Xavier, for public health safety. Hashtag public mag public I just this trick has really just broken me to be honest. Oh my god! Oh my god! No, 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 wait! wait. <laughs> if I ever saw that in real life, that's exactly how I'd be acting. Oh my god, oh my god, wait, wait, wait! The next magician is also a name that I am unbelievably bad at pronouncing. This is why my name is simply just Sean Does Magic because it's three words that are unbelievably easy to say. His name is, I believe, Jack Yu. Jack Yu. Sure, we're gonna say that. Every time I watch his magic inside a hand, it blows me away. I said this in my hate comments video, but I'm by far not the best magician on the planet. This is one of the people that I'll be like, hey, this dude is way better than me. Hi, I'm Magician Jackie Yu mm. here. Handkerchief, and this is glass table, right? Mm. And I have four cards four in my cards. hand. See? One, two, three, four. Mm. Snap. One, two, three, snap. There was four, and now there's three. One, two, three, four. Four. Snap. One, two, three, snap. There's three. One, two. Two. One card left. See? Oh! Done. That's, I don't like that. That makes me mad. Jackie you or however you say your name. How do you do that? <laughs> like being 100% honest, my magician brain can pick apart some stuff. I'm like looking, I'm like, okay, all right, all right. And then he just makes the whole thing disappear and I'm like, where, what, how? Done. And this is glass table. Hello. <laughs> He smiles right at the end and says, oh my. And he says it like that, cause he knows he fucking got you. Anyways, with that being said, let's watch two more of his videos. I have a four cards in my hand. Okay, wait, wait. 
First of all, there's a timer going on in the background. Okay, cool. The, I, I believe he's putting that so he knows that there are no cuts in the videos or whatnot. Number two, the table is glass, just like last time. And number three, the caption says magic revealed. So does that mean we're learning magic today? I need to learn from someone as good as him. So let's hope I learn something. Uh, if I put the cards one by one like this, see it changed. Those cards just shrunk. Is he gonna teach me this? I hope he teaches me this, hold up. It's a mini card, mini card. That's not mini cards no more. In the span of literally just a few seconds, he made the cards go small and then super big. It's not a mini card. What's here? One, two, three, four. What is it's good. You wanna know the secret? The secret is I have a hole in my hand. You have a hole. Let me show you. See, here's a hole. That's so I not the secret, Jack You Stop playing with me. I put the cards here inside. And yesterday, I put the coin here. Watch. Oh my. Again, I love the dude. But there's just some people in this world that make me feel like I am worthless. Good job. Good job. That was good. All right, so this next one was on the hashtag magic tag on TikTok, and it got almost 17 million views. So we're going to watch it. Maybe we'll get amazed. Magic trick. Okay. Mmm, napkin. In the hand. All right, vanish. It's not gonna be gone. That. Magic. <laughs> good one. You're so funny. The next person that we're gonna be reacting to is a good friend of mine. His name is Joel Magician. We've worked together in the past and he's absolutely insane at what he does. Again, magicians that I can point to and be like, he is really, really freaking good. It's my man, Joel. So let's react to this. We need the magic trick. Watch, watch, watch. That looks so clean. As you may or may not know, I do do that trick. Obviously, I know how it's done, but phenomenal performance. Let's keep watching. Oh, what? That's a 10 out of 10. Ooh, got that 10 out of 10 off the bat. Read the magic trick. Bang. I'm sorry. Okay, now that, that one's a, I don't want to say it because I know Joel, but that, you might have got me on that one. Just a little bit. Ooh, 7 out of 10. Okay, 7 out of 10. All right, that's good. I like that one. Read the magic trick. If I can turn this water into wine. I'm sorry. Did he just say he wants to be God? Excuse me? I don't think so. I'm a watch, but I don't think so. Would that deserve a follow? Yes, but there's absolutely no way that you can. Oh. Frick you, Joel. Frick you. And I'm, I'm being nice because you're my friend, but frick you. What? <laughs> So good. What? The 10 out of 10. Double 10 out of 10s in the video. He got, he managed to get two 10 out of 10s in one video. And my mom over here just roasting me. Mom, rate the magic trick. Watch your $100 bill. All you have to do is scratch. And just like that, it's a long $100 hey, bill. Zero out of 10. Why? What you do with my hand? Mom. Rate? Jesus, Joel. Okay, let's watch another one. Rate the magic trick. I'm sorry, what? He literally, literally, literally just a Rubik's Cube on a card, which for one, why is there Rubik's Cubes on cards? That makes no sense. But it was a printed Rubik's Cube and then suddenly it's a real Rubik's Cube. I, I can do Rubik's Cube magic too, right? Watch this. On the count of three, there's gonna be a Rubik's Cube in my hand. Three, two, one, bam. A Rubik's Cube. <laughs> um. Anyways, let's keep going. Magic trick. What just happened? Did he just have a seizure? You did magic so good that he spoke another language. 10 out of 10. What? Read the magic trick. Watch. Oreo? Oh, nothing happened, so 0 out of 10. 8 out of 10. That's really good. I was going to make a joke about it, but... That that's just a really good trick. There's a version of this trick where you literally just bite the cookie and then you make it restore. But Joel made it way better for social media. So I just <laughs> eight out of ten. You mean eighty out of ten? That was sick. And fair play. Read the magic trick. If I can make this chewing gum disappear, would that deserve a follow? Hey, yes, but that's not gonna happen. Oh my god. <laughs> That's a 10 out of 10. Oh my God, Joel, you just, man, this is just so freaking good, man. Like we have just watched a ton and I mean a ton of really, really good magic. You know what? I'm, I need, my ego is hurting a little bit. We're going to watch at least one bad magic. So there's this creator named Wean Magic. I'm sure he's a decent magician, but he creates these interesting magic videos. And, and you know what? Prop Sam, he, he gets views. Like this has 19 million views. We're going to watch this and then we're going to talk about it. 
Okay, so we got a fake ice cream cone. Ice cube turns into ice cream. <laughs> okay, alright, 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 alright. Alright, cute little magic video. There's a few problems that I have with this video. And listen, I'm not perfect. I'm gonna be the first one to say that I'm not perfect, alright? I'm uh, I'm looking at this and I'm seeing that I got a lot of views and I'm gonna... I'm gonna complain. First and foremost, he comes up to this random guy at the table, right? And the first thing he does is takes his drink and dumps it out. He literally just grabs his drink. He's like, hey, hey, random person, I know I didn't approach you prior to this, but I'm just gonna grab your cup and dump it out. He just literally just grabs it and just dumps it. And the guy's like, huh? And then obviously he grabs an ice cube and then the ice cube turns into ice cream. That's cool, that's awesome. The second problem that I have with this video, in all of these videos that he does where he does magic in public for some reason everyone and their mom stops what they're doing in the background to watch this magic trick you'll see in a little bit when I show you another video but everybody and I mean everybody just stops what they're doing to watch the magic and that's how you immediately know it's a fake it's not real all right bites the gingerbread and bam but look at everyone in the back, every single customer in that store stopped what they were doing. Even the cashier who was checking out that customer stopped what they were doing just to react to a magic trick. Realistically, that's not happening. That's not. I remember there was this one time where I literally was like pulling a giant straw out of my bag. That was not a fake video and no one in the background cared that I was pulling this dry out. And I know what you might be thinking, Sean, that's easy to criticize, you know, other magicians, but like, you know, honestly, on my end, at least I've never done a McDonald's magic video. That's not, that's not me. That's not me and Evan doing magic at McDonald's. That's clearly fake. That might be me. I might be a hypocrite. And you know what? In terms of hypocrisy, let's just watch this video. This was literally one of the first videos I ever did with Evan. And listen, I, all I can say is at least I'm making better videos now. But for the memes and for the hypocrisy, <laughs> let's react to this. Yo, Sean, what's up? I'm gonna make this disappear, okay? That's cheating. Oh, that's, not, that's cheating. That's cheating. Look at me being all corny and funny. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Okay, okay. For real, let's watch this. Watch carefully. Okay. Take the okay. nugget. <laughs> Where did it go? Look at the top of your head. No. No, no. <laughs> Look at my face. Look at my face. Oh my god, that nugget that was on top of my head that I totally didn't feel. I'm just, I'm bringing this up because obviously, as much as I want to criticize others, there is content that I make myself that you can criticize. I think that's a good spot to end the video. I hope you guys enjoyed me reacting to a bunch of magicians on TikTok. If you guys want to see a part three to this video, let me know in the comment section down below. Let me know who are your favorite magicians, obviously besides me. But, but if you like want to comment me, like that's fine too. Like feel free. Like actually just comment me. If you guys do want to see a part three, let me know by hitting that like button and the subscribe button down below. I really do appreciate y'all. Guys, we hit 3.6 million today on YouTube, which is freaking insanity. It's nuts. Confetti fly everywhere. Woo! I feel like that was the first time I asked my editor to do like an edit and it actually came out as confetti. Can we do it two for two? Confetti! Okay. I knew my luck was going to end. But anyways, I've been talking for way too long. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. And I will catch y'all in the next video. You know the vibe. And I'm out. Oh my god! No way! Oh no. What? <laughs> I gotta get- Yo!